Hello everybody. So today I want to show you how to find about the tangents, but they can create about horizontal and vertical tangents. The first thing we need to find about dy over dx. So we need to do first the derivative for the both side. And we have like this. So for this one, we have s square, and that this one that is about two s. This one, we need to do first the derivative of s multiplied by y. Later that, we need to do first the derivative of y multiplied by s this one we have 2y and we have dy over dx this one you got number 0 so this one we have number 1 this one we have first the derivative of y and that is about dy over the s. Next, I will put this one go to the right. Then we can do about factorization by this one. Next, we divide both sides by this one. So we want to create about horizontal tangents. So this one equals to number zero. That means y minus two s equals to number zero. So we have y equals to two s. Now we return back to this one. So I will put this one go in here and here. And now we need to expand this one, and that is about two s square, and we have four s square. Next, this one number one plus number four, we have number five. Five minus number two, we have three s square. Later, that we divide both side by number three, and we have s equals to number 3 and s equals to negative number 3 because we have this one so we have y equals to number 6 and y equals to negative number 6 now we can do similar for ds or for dy we use this one and this one we have two s the s over dy. This one that is about first derivative of s, so we have the s over dy. Later that we do first derivative of y. We have number one. This one we have two y. This one you got number zero. So I will put this one go to the right and we have s minus 2y. Later that we can do about factorization by this one. Next, we divide both sides by this one. So in this case, we have this one equals to number zero. And we have like this. So we put two y go to here. So we do the same.
and we got the final answer so y equals to number 3 y equals to negative number 3 so we put back for s so that is about s equals to number 6 s equals to negative number 6 and this is the technique how to answer this is the end thank you for watching